Right, in today's vlog, my friends, a bit of a different vlog. Because we're doing, we're doing car share. Oh, wow. Yeah, 80s car share. We're I going... weren't around in those days. You weren't around in the 80s. Yeah, no. I bet you weren't. <laughs> I, know, I know what you were doing in the 80s. Hey! Anyway, in today's vlog, we are going back in time to the 70s and 80s everything it's a bit of nostalgia i want you guys to join in in the comment section down below down below do you know do you do that just do that go i don't do that but some people do go you, you, down below they, 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 i've said this before all the old people my mom, my mom used to i used get to, it at work all the time well go, especially when i was working in the hospital but then like obviously not so much now because i'm private but they go down below <laughs> they just Anyway, where's this going? There's nothing to do with the 80s. We're talking 70s, we're talking 80s, we're talking chocolate bars, we're talking TV programmes, we're talking cars, anything nostalgic from the 70s and 80s. Because at the moment, let's be honest, it's 2022, we're going into 2023, and to be quite honest, it's crap, isn't it? Everybody's woke, you can't say anything, you can't do anything. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Whereas back then, you could say what you want and do what you want within reason, and nobody bothered. Yeah. You know, it was all... It don't seem to be much respect for other people these days, does they? No, you can't say anything. It's like I said I said about man food the other day. There was a couple of couple of comments I had to delete. <laughs> thought, I'm only having a laugh. <laughs> I've got three daughters. What's the matter with you? You know, and I've trained them all to wash up. Yeah. <laughs> controversial, <laughs> controversial. Anyway, I'm just kidding. See, back in the day. Yeah. If you are new to the channel, please do hit the subscribe button. This is just going to be a bit of fun. There's no food in it. I might have a donut on the way, actually. I do fancy something a bit sweet. Um. Anyway, if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. Click the little bell for notifications of when I upload new videos. And I'll see and, and I'll see you in the next one. I've got that wrong, haven't I? Without yeah. further ado, my friends, I'm leaving it in. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> right, I'll start because you know what? I've said to Ange, think of some stuff. I said, think of some things back in. She went, I don't, I can't remember. <laughs> I can't remember. I said, what were you doing in the 80s? Well, I was at school. Yeah, well, we know what you, I don't want to know what you were doing at school. Oh. It was Ucknell. Anyway, we'll start off. Kids TV programmes. Who remembers Bod? Here comes Bod. Remember, B, O, oh. Do. I remember Bod. the name, I don't remember Bod. much else. I think the music was... Oh yes, I do now. It was something like that. It yeah. was Because even the music, it was great. Bod. That was fantastic, Bod was. And, and then let's go into another one. Button Moon. After Button Moon, you followed Mr. Spoon Button Moon. Button moon. We're after Button Moon. Follow Mr. <laughs> Spoon Button Moon. <laughs> it was great. Back then was honestly the flumps. The flumps. <laughs> Did it see? <laughs> da -da -da -da. The the, yeah, and at the end it said go da -da 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 -da. <laughs> It was great. it was bloody it was. brilliant back then. Loved it. What about Rainbow? <clears throat> when did Rainbow finish? Oh come on, Rainbow is a classic, wasn't it? Yeah. Do you know I can't talk to Sarah about this because yeah, she's, she's a lot younger, than, she's us, a lot younger she? than me. She's ten years younger than me. And I used to talk about it to her, to her late mother, bless her, and I, because uh, she used to be, I think she was 10, 15 years older than me, and she used to watch Rainbow and all them different things, and it, this is what, it, it's, it's the nostalgia from back in the day, and I wow, really miss good. it. Rainbow up above the streets and houses, <laughs> Rainbow. Climbing high, everyone can see it smiling over the sky. I had a crush on uh, Jane. Oh, it must have been good, Jeffrey. Yes, I'm sure you all would have enjoyed it. 
Oh, what a shame, because there won't be another craft fair for ages. Oh, well, never mind. We'll just have to wait until the next one. Remember Rod, Rod, Jane and Freddy? Yeah. Yeah, I used to have a crush on Rod, Jane and Freddy. It's crazy, isn't it? I, uh, fame was my favourite. Fame? Yeah. Who were The musical, because I used to go dancing in a place in Hognall that used to do fame dancing. Fame dancing? And that was all I was dancing and like, it was like disco sort of, but the, the, the dancing that came from the programme, the, the TV. Program. Yeah. Fame. Would you, I'll let you into a secret. Go on then. I bought the record, the single, Hi, hi fidelity. Hi, hi fidelity. <laughs> How many times fidelity. did you play with it? Uh, are we talking about the record? Yeah. It's a family channel, actually. You know. when, I, when I was a teenager, quite a lot. <laughs> family channel? Family channel. I'm talking about the record. I mean, music was better back then. Um, but, I mean, children's TV programmes. Who remembers Pipkins? Pipkins. There's Pig. And Hartley. Yes, that yeah. was another one, wasn't Hartley. it? Hartley. Mm -hmm. And it was like this wiry hair. It was, you know, it was Hartley hair, Pipkins. I, back then in the day, things were better. Doctor Who, for instance, everybody has yeah. their own Doctor Who. My Doctor Who was Tom Baker. Hello. Oh. Come to see me off, have you? Well, I hate goodbyes. Caught the end of John Pertwee, but and, and John Pertwee, Wurzel Gummidge. Yeah, them some titchy humans. This is Christmas Eve, this is. Oh, Wurzel and Aunt Sally, they were was amazing, wasn't it? Cup of what tea, was the Aunt other Sally. one? Um, oh, and the cat weasel with the chain round his neck. What was that? Mr. One? T, Mr. T, hey, are you crazy fool? What you doing, sucker? Yes, that, that ain't going on no plane. That, the that 18. Was that, the 18. That, that was, was the eight. Do you see? You I, can remember as well. You can. I bet you can remember. Even times of the things when they came on. I used to sit with my dad and I'd watch Quincy medical. <laughs> did, uh, what was it? Quincy with oh, Jack Klugman. Was... Did I can't, oh, I can't remember the theme music to it. <laughs> did, did, oh, but I watched it Tuesday. Uh, nine o'clock, BBC Two, uh, and it was and it was Quincy, and yeah. I'd watch that, and then I'd watch another one when we had uh, we had Sky TV. I got my dad to buy Amstrad Sky TV, uh, and I used to watch Twenty One Jump Street with uh, Johnny Depp in it. Uh, that was back in the late eighties, I think that was. I absolutely love stuff back in the day. Um, I mean, if you look back, uh, it, it, chocolate bars, for instance, oh, right? Oh, haven't they changed? They've gone so small now, haven't they? Ch you, they was massive before, yeah. and now they're like, Mars bars was like about that, and now like that for, you know, things. Somebody said, comments down below, by the way, Mars bars have changed their recipe now and fluffed it up into like a, a milky way. way kind of so so it's cheaper because it's it's filled full of air basically. But back I said that we mentioned about man food the other day yeah. and I mentioned about Yorkie and Yorkies are so thin now they used to break your teeth back in the day and that's what you wanted. <laughs> you were a man and you <laughs> broke your teeth. I found it the road from coast to coast. Yorkie and me rolling on. You know, and uh, it, but it, it, everything's got smaller. Who remembers uh, Trio? Trio! Too loud. Trio! I said that was too loud. I want a trio and I want one now. Yeah. The adverts, the TV commercial for Trio is a chocolate bar. Oh, yes, I trio. remember that one. Yeah, and then you'd got, uh, uh, there was United. But even I'm delighted to eat United. Chocolate yes, bars. Yes, they were, weren't they? United when was Chocolate James bars. Harriet on? That was one I used to watch, the vet programme. James, all, all creatures yeah, great and it. small. They, so they, they brought that back recently, but it, I don't no, think it's, it's in the same. It won't be the same, was it? It won't be the same. There's, I mean, I, I used to watch uh, Night Rider. There was Night Rider. As a lad, yes. you know, I watched Night Rider with with Kit and with all the screens <laughs> in his, which is like this now, isn't it? Yeah. Um, and you know, silent mode Kit, which is basically <laughs> this. But I also watched Street Hawk. 
He's been recruited for a top secret government mission to ride Street Hawk, an all-terrain attack motorcycle designed to fight urban crime. Which was my favourite over the... Uh, I actually liked Street Hawk better than Knight Rider, and that was the um, motorbike. Jesse Mark, an ex-motorcycle cop, injured in the line of duty. This is Jesse Mark, an ex-motorcycle cop, injured in the line of duty. An all-terrain motorcycle. I remember, see, I remember all this. What about the man from Atlantis? And then at the end, it used one. to say, that Patrick Duffy in his yellow oh, shorts. Yeah. And at the end, it would go, do not try this at home. It's done with specialist equipment, blah, blah, blah. You know, the man from Atlantis, come no. on. Neighbours. Neighbours. Neighbor. Used that, to record. Uh, with Jason Donovan yeah, and uh, Kylie Minogue. Kylie Minogue. And yes, used to have that recorded. That was more before. 90s though, wasn't it? Neighbors? I don't know, was it? Yeah, I'd say more 90s that was. I mean, back in the day when you had Coronation Street. I thought it was on when I was still in the last few years at school. I don't know, somebody tell me when it was first started. Yeah, yeah, I mean, more kids, I mean, Grain Jill back then. Oh, did, gosh, did, that was did, good, did, 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 I always put the sausage in where the, you know, the sausage <laughs> comes down, the bang or whatever. And you've got Mrs. McCluskey, and yeah, you've got Zamo, you've got, uh, who is it, Roland. Don't mind being called Gutsy. Do you, Gutsy? Do ya? you got Roland and stuff, <laughs> and it was, it was it Tucker Jenkins. Marion Edwards. William Graham. Yes. Things back then were better. That's they good. were better. I mean, if you look at it, uh, the, we go back to chocolate bars and stuff. Do you remember Texan? Texan show sure is a mighty chew. All you gotta do is, hey, any last re he'd say any last requests, and he'd go, yeah, I'll have a Texan, and then he'd be like, you know, they'd all be asleep. <laughs> but it was, it was. The, the, the TV commercials were back then was really? better as well. I mentioned one the other day. Um, will it be chips or jackets, yes. spuds? Will it be salad or frozen peas? Will it be mushrooms? And then the guy goes, Friday. Yeah, I think you watch too much TV. I used to sit watching TV all the time. I watched <laughs> the Rockford Files with my dad. This is Jim Rockford. At the tone, leave your name and message. I'll get back to you. I used to be playing. I used to be playing in the street, playing Kirby. Doing what? Kirby. Kirby. Yeah. You, what you used to do is where I grew up. It was a dead end, so it was a really nice road, but it was a dead end at the Hulk top. Oh, is a bit of a dead end, isn't it? <laughs> my road was really nice. So, but the curve, someone said, and you used to have to throw your, your ball across from one side, and if it bounced and come back, it was a point to that person. So it was called Kirby. Never heard of it. Me elastic. Never elastic? Yeah, that we used to skip in and do. What are you on about? Oh, the, the, what we used to do in the 80s. 80s? I was playing on my ZX Spectrum. <laughs> I loved it. Commodore. Just a little story for you here. Commodore 60. Oh, yeah, I you were those. a Commodore. Oh, come on a minute. Yeah. There was a, the, you were either in, you were either at one side of the wall or the other. You were in, we you were the Commodore 64. You were posh then if yes, you had both. Commodore lovely. 64 or ZX Spectrum. I did have a Commodore 64 eventually. I had a Commodore Plus 4 as well. S see if anybody remembers. <laughs> <laughs> that one, uh, an, an Acorn Electron, and my favourite game was Chucky Egg on the Acorn Electron. <laughs> it was brilliant. But the, the ZX Spectrum was a fantastic. Tell you a little story, right? My dad um, at Christmas we went to Cameo Cameras and he bought me a ZX Spectrum, and it was a 16K one. It was 99 quid. There's 16K and 48K, and really you needed the 48K one to get all the best games. Then he got the 16K when I said, oh, that'll do, you know, I said, it's... Uh, and I wanted Trans Am, uh, the game Trans Am it was. Uh, stick with me, it's, it's, it's quite emotional, this one. And uh, it's, it, so he got it, me, and it was a 16K one. I thought, I don't want him to spend any more money, you know, although I was a spoiled little brat. Anyway, Christmas Day comes, and I open up the presents, and he went, open that one first, and it was Trans Am, and I thought, how does he know I want that? And I went, oh, I said, I can't play that it's only for the 
48k <laughs> spectrum and it's the 16k one i opened it up 48k spectrum and i went wow ah, and he went listen he said if you're gonna have it you've got to have the best one he went back and swapped it for the 48k you know what those are the days that are it's bringing a bit of a tear to my eye actually because and here's a stand up of my arm it really was way <laughs> way better back then and other tv Good programs come think think of some other ones cockle shell oh. bay cockle shell bay is a town near the sea with seagulls and sunshine and sound. Robbie and Rosie, Cockle Shell Bay. Yeah. Remember that? No. No? Oh, I've got one for you. See if you remember this one. Chocky. Chocky, you don't remember. What were you, what were you doing in the seventies and eighties? I, mean, I didn't watch. I still don't watch a lot of TV now. What you know, You should be watching me. <laughs> Chocky. I, I need to watch Lee. Chocky, right? Was this lad, and he, it was an imag It was either an imaginary friend from outer space or something. I can't remember. It was called Chocky, and I even I find myself doom scrolling sometimes. <laughs> and I doom scrolled. What's the guy, What's the actor from Chocky? He was a little boy. What's he doing now? And he's some kind of professor, I think. Have a look, search for me and tell me in the comment section down below. <laughs> um, the other, the other stuff that was on TV back then. I mean, come on, He-Man, She-Ra, On the Buses, which I think was 70s, wasn't it? On the Buses was great. You'd got, you'd got open all hours. I used to love that. Oh, yeah, that was funny, wasn't it? Man About the House, Richard O'Sullivan. I, I even doom scrolled about Richard, <laughs> Richard, Richard O'Sullivan. What's he doing now? <laughs> He's in a care home in Twickenham, I think it is. Aww. Obviously, this is this is what I do. You think I have like a rock and roll lifestyle? <laughs> I sit there at night just doom scrolling on endless stuff from back in the eighties. There was a thing called CBTV uh, back in the day, and I think that had got Tommy Boyd on it, who was originally in Magpie. Uh, remember Magpie? Yes, I mentioned that in the vlog the other day. Uh, Mick Robinson, or Mick Robertson, and apparently he's got something to do with kids' TV now as well. And uh, I, it was just way better back then. You'd got Blue Peter, and the presenters of Blue Peter were. Oh, and the animals pooing on the floor. The animals pooing on the floor. On Blue Peter, they used to come on sometimes, and if I ever watched, there'd be an elephant or something, I'd have a right big poo or something on the floor. In the studio. I, right, I don't remember that. So you didn't watch Blue Peter very much? Of course then. I watched Blue Peter <laughs> where they had the Blue Peter garden and they buried all the memorabilia back then and stuff like that. You used to have TV adverts as well from from at Christmas. <laughs> Christmas TV adverts. I know. They were even they were better back in the day. You'd got Q QC, sir. What does QC stand for? <laughs> Quiet Christmas or whatever. So relax with QC. Quite charming. You remember that one? No. You've got your Woolworths adverts from Christmas as well. They were they were classic yeah, Woolworths adverts. Yeah, Woolworths ones. The latest, greatest, ever more spectacular Woolworths oh, Christmas show. show. Milk, tray, chocolates, sweet bear all for feet. Yeah, the Woolworths, you've got Curry's TV <laughs> and stuff like that. There's a sensational range of gifts that Curry is now. A massive choice at unbeatable prices. It was brilliant by then. Christmas adverts were brilliant by then. Do you remember the, the one for the, uh, for the Volkswagen Golf advert? And... The woman had got a fur coat on or something and she ended up throwing throwing the coat down or something and she'd just got her keys to a VW Golf or Polo or whatever. And everyone must play the game uh, today and gone tomorrow. And she was happy, that was it. I think she was getting a divorce or something. No? You don't remember that one? I remember that one. Do you remember that one? Pop it in the comments section down below. <coughs> and then, the other, t 
Ch chocolate bars back then. We've gone on about this, oh, but no. chocolate bars back then, right? Curly what Whirlies. Did... I was in the Curly Whirly Club. Do you remember uh, Curly Whirlies and Terry Scott? Ha <laughs> ha! This Curly Whirly, with all its miles of chewy toffee, covered in creamy cabbage chocolate, is ten minutes old and only costs three p. From Terry and June. I can, oh, I do. Terry, yes. see, we're going off on a tangent here. Terry and June. I can. This is our. This is our <laughs> sad arm. Are you ready? Go on. Yeah. Was funny did, that. Did, 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 did. June. <laughs> I mean, if you look back, it was probably garbage if you watch it now. Medford, wasn't it? Terry and June, June Medford, yes. I think it was. Good grief. But the comedies back then, you had. Uh, what was the one where he was? Was it Please Sir? Where he was a. Uh, it, it was a. Te was he a teacher? Please Sir. There was Please Sir. And what was the. What was the. The school one where they were. Was it the. Fenchurch Street, the guy out there. You, uh, going on from that one again, do you remember the Tunes advert? F f second class return ticket to Do oh, Dottingham, yes. please. Second class return to Dottingham, please. Where was that, sir? I said Dottingham. Tunes! <laughs> Helps you breathe more easily. <laughs> that was an advert, wasn't it? Oh, it was weird. And uh, bubblegum back then as well, Anglo bubbly. Yes. Used to have a um, when I grew when I was in the lakes. I spent a lot of time up there. They didn't have any shops where I was, where my mum and uh, lived, where her house was. And we had a mobile van that came round, a mobile shop, and that was the highlight of Saturday morning because there was nothing else around <laughs> for miles. You had to play in the in the woods, in the forest. So I'd wait for the van to come round and have an Anglo bubbly after watching Champion the Wonder Horse. Do you remember that? Yeah, I do yeah. remember. Champion the Wonder Horse. Champion the Wonder Horse. You'd also got the littlest hobo. There's a voice that keeps on calling me. I don't remember that. What were you doing in the 70s oh, and 80s? You. How I'd can you not? Out, we've been women roller skating, ice skating. How can you not remember Champion the Wonder Horse? I probably didn't watch loads of stuff. Yeah, it was fantastic. I was, I then... was always, I was a really an outgoing. Um, I grew up and my dad had a boat and I learned to windsurf and I did all sorts. So I was out a you lot. Did, in those you days. not lived. You should I have been know. inside watching TV. I, know. I mean, there, there was some great stuff on TV at the time. Swap, swap shop. Please tell oh, me you remember right. Swap Shop. Swap, I do remember or that. Or Tiz was. Yes, and my brother actually won something on the Saturday morning one. What? Which? What? Swap Shop? Yes. Because you'd got... Uh, it was... Um, it was Noel Edmonds. Yes. And then you'd also got um, Keith Chegwin. Yeah. Uh, both and it, Maggie Philbin, it? who ended up marrying Keith Chegwin, didn't yeah. he, I think. Um, absolutely fantastic. Were you Tiz was or Swap Shop? That's the thing, you <laughs> see. I used to ask everybody that. He, you can tell somebody by you go tis was a shop swap shop what were you you always get the ones that go kind of switch and flicked between both but i was more of a tis was Sunday, Saturday, Saturday is tis was day. with lenny henry and the phantom <laughs> flanflinger oh it was there. come on and then I'd, i fancied what's the name off of there as well what was the name Oh, I can't come on, the put names. a name in the comments section. I can't remember a name off of uh, Tiz Was. Oh, she was really fit, I can't remember. Oh, man. I mean, uh, music was, be was better back then. Come on, 80s music, yes. it was way better. You've got Culture Club, you've got Wham. Yeah, it was Duran Duran. Duran Duran, that was it, yeah. Duran Duran, Spandau Ballet. Yeah, there was all good ones, wasn't they? Everything was way, way, way better. I love then. listening to still the 80s. I've even done the Butlins weekend. That's a really good weekend. What, Butlins 80s? 80s weekend, Ooh, yeah. I might have to vlog that. That would be a good one for us to do. I've yeah. done. I've actually done the 60s, the 70s, the 80s, and it's the 90s I want to go on next. Ooh. I used to watch... I used to watch... Um, because I, I had Sky, I was, I was the part, actually I had Sky and who remembers this? I bet you, bet you won't remember this. The Squareal BSB. There it is, 
Signed, sealed and delivered. Five new channels, all at the touch of a button. Oh. No. And it was the opposition to Sky. But event, it lasted about, it was better quality. It came from the Marco Polo satellite. And it was way better quality, but it didn't last because Sky was, it was, you know, the VHS and Betamax kind of thing. Who remembers Scotch TV tapes? Scotch tapes, re oh, no. re-record, not fade away. <laughs> re-record, not fade away. Re-record, not fade away. <laughs> re-record, not fade away. And you've got uh, Toshiba. Hello, 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 Tosh, got a Toshiba. <laughs> Yeah. Hello, Tosh. Got Hello. a Toshiba. Did you used to record the top uh, top top forty? And then on your tape, and then it was like you could play it over and over again, couldn't you? And all the adverts, you had to pause it. While there the was adverts no adverts. On. It, it was, was on. BBC. What was that? I do. You actually used to have to get the adverts off or something, or they used to know the talking or something. Was it? In no. It? When, I, when I watched, it was it was on it, when I listened. It was on BBC with Tommy Vance. This is Tommy Vance. This is Tommy Vance. This is the top 40 countdown. And you've got uh, past the Dutch Heap on the left hand side. Uh, you'd, you, they were singing, and then you'd also go, What about different strokes? World don't move to the beat of just one drum. Steaming up in here, isn't it? Yeah. We're just going to. I've turned the, uh, the fan off, and it's steaming up. Um, what about different strokes? Didn't watch that. You did not watch different strokes? No. Oh, come on. What are you talking about, Willis? What you talking about, Willis? I can't remember that one. Where were you in the 70s and 80s? I'm going to have to switch this on. on my bike. How can you not remember different strokes? I mean, come oh. on. Have a word with her, will you? <laughs> Just have a word in the comment section down below. How can... Different strokes was brilliant. It was. I, see it. I can't. Well, I can't remember. When it. the world don't beat to the sound of just one drum, <laughs> what might be right for you, maybe oh, not, may not be right it, for some. I can't remember that one. No. No. Come on, greatest American hero. That was where he, 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 he couldn't fly or whatever, and he had to cut some kind of cape or whatever. You don't remember that? Smokey and the Bandits, I watched. Smokey and the Bandits. T please tell me, <laughs> please tell me that, uh, well, is that closed now? Please tell me that you remember the Bionic Man, the six million dollar yes. man. <laughs> oh, he's, we're, we're a bit. Yeah. I'm breaking up, she's breaking up. She's breaking up, she's breaking up. Do, 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 we have the power to rebuild him. Fantastic, loved it. Yeah. I was named after Lee Majors. Was you? Yeah, I was named after Lee Majors, um, and uh, no one fancied Lee Majors, so there we go. So I got the name. I got named Lee. Um, <laughs> Bless her. You had um, what else from back from back in the day? Because we got all the American stuff coming as well. Starsky and Hutch. Yeah. Do you know there were two theme tunes to Starsky and Hutch? There was another one that went that kind of thing. There was Starsky and Hutch. You'd got Columbo, loved Columbo from back in the day. Always used to go out and the guy would think he'd got away with it and he'd come back in and he'd go, Oh, there's one more thing, sir. Just one more thing. Do you remember that? No. Well, you didn't watch Columbo? I think I've seen it once or twice. Oh, shit. What was you doing? Please. Tam, 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 oh, tam. now I'm going this way first. Are you? Yeah, I'm going this way. But have a word with it, will you? <laughs> what I were you doing? I, honestly, I I watched some TV, but we was always busy. Like, night time, I'd come home from school and have homework, and then sit watch a little bit of TV. But often on weekends, we used to be out a lot. How can you have missed all this blockbusters? Yeah, I remember that. Remember that? Blockbusters? Yeah. I'll have a pee, please, Bob. <laughs> <laughs> Can I have a pee, please, Bob? And that generation game and all those. Who was in the generation game? What's his name? Putting under pressure here, you see. You see, I can't, I can't remember. Well, Bruce you'd Forsyth. Got, yeah, but you've got Bruce Forsyth and you'd also got Shut That Door, Larry, Shut That Door, Larry Grayson. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you look very good. You look very good tonight. Thank you. Shame about the legs. Anyway. <laughs>
Yes. Yeah, I spoke to him once because I was doing, I was doing some graphics for the uh, Mansfield uh, Civic Theatre, and it was about two in the morning. And I was at the Chad newspaper, and I had to ri I had to ring him for something. It was to, <laughs> he said, "Don't worry, ring." And I rang Larry Grayson, and I was like, "Oh, I was in awe." <laughs> <laughs> what about Super Match Game? Super Match Game. Yeah. I remember that. What's that? Come on. Can't remember, but I remember it. Have a word with you. Have a word with it. Blankety blank. Yeah, remember that. Blankety blank. Blankety blank. Who, who did that? Who did blankety blank? Mm, Come can't on. Remember his name. Come on. It. it, it how can, Terry Wogan. That's it. And Les Dawson did it as yes, well. Yes, he did, didn't he? Les Dawson did it. Game shows back then. What about? I'm going to do a. Going to do a. Right. Can you get this one? It was. Uh, oh, do you know? What? It's gone out of my head now. Uh, the, the, Da, 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 da. Three, two, one. Remember it? Three, two, one. Ted Rogers. Three, two, one. Yeah. You do remember it, don't you? Yeah. Go no, on. You what, said what was three, the two, what was I the main? I can't remember anything else about it. Dusty Bin. Yes, that's it. You're the wrong person to do an eighties video know, with, I aren't you? I told you that I wouldn't remember a lot of it. Uh, what were you doing in the eighties? I don't know. Uh, come on, seventies and eighties. Those were the days. <laughs> Game shows were better back then as well. You'd got Heidi High as well. Yes. Remember Heidi High? Hello, campers. Please tell me you remember yeah, Ted Bovis, Heidi yeah. High Campers, ding, <laughs> ding, ding. Ruth Maddock used to fancy her. Did you? Yeah, I did. Everything was better back then, way better back then. Saturday night, I used to, I'd be up at the lakes, my mum would get me a, a, one of them chocolate bars. There was a Cadbury's Animal Chocolate Bar, I think it was, right? We're going for a donut, treating you to a donut. Oh. Um, animal Chocolate Bar, I'd have a bath. Right, because we, you wouldn't have a shower back then. It was always baths back then, wasn't it? It was. You'd have a bath. Nowadays, you just have a shower. Uh, and uh, we'd have, I'd have my bath. I'd have. She'd, she'd do my hair for me and everything. You know, she'd come in and she'd. My mum would come in in the bath. I'd only be. I'd be about seven or eight, and she'd be like, "Make sure you wash. Make sure you wash your widdly." <laughs> and I'm like, "What? What, mum?" And then she, anyway, then you'd go. <laughs> And then you'd go, I'd go into the uh, living room, into the lounge, call it the lounge, and uh, Juliet Bravo would be on. And then after Juliet Bravo, it was 3 2 1 with Ted Rogers, and then that was it. I got to watch that, and it was bedtime. You're a right TV person. Oh man, I absolutely loved TV back then. I mean, I. I, I Everything I watched on TV back in the 80s was absolutely fantastic. Come on, think. So what were you I'm doing? I'm rubbish. I can't. I, I, it's not that I can't remember them, but I just forget certain things. Cartoons yeah. back then. Hong Kong Fui. <laughs> Hong Kong Fui. Number one super guy. Number one super guy. Yeah, I remember Hong Kong Fui. Quicker than a human eye. Do you remember, remember that? Yeah, I do remember Hong Kong that. Fooey. Come on, name some in the comment section. Help her along. Yeah, She's... I'm rubbish. I yeah. am. Hong Kong Fooey. Uh, what about uh, Touche Away? Touche Turtle. Touche Away! <coughs> mm, I'm not sure about that one. I used to watch Heidi. Was that in the 80s? Heidi did. did, 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 did. Yeah. So I even remember the music for that. <laughs> you, what, where were you? Oh, well, I watched Cartoons. Some, wasn't I, what about uh, In the Wonderland Zoo? In the Wonderland Zoo, where the surgeon bears are. Well, where the surgeon bears are. Was it the Hair Bear Bunch? Yes, I remember that. The Hair Bear Bunch, yeah. Remember the Hair Bear Bunch? Then there was oh, other cartoons. Come on. You'd got Touche Turtle. You'd got. Uh, what about Batfink? You can't harm me. My wings are like a shield of steel. My wings are like a shield of steel. Yeah, I remember that. J Johnny Bravo with the big hair. Remember Johnny yes. Bravo? And then you got Top Cat. Which way is the uh, Dunkin' Donuts? Is it up there? It's up that one over there. No, it's, that, that's to Newark. We don't, we're not no, going to Newark. It is. You need to be on that one. Where? Mansfield's left. I'm going over here. Yeah, but you need to go. You're going on to the bypass, aren't you? Yeah. So you need to go straight up. 
That's going to oh, near oh, it. Oh, yeah, you're right. Yeah, left. Sorry. What are you on? What, what have you been I'm taking? I'm just thinking what road we've come down. A different one. Right, come on. Cartoons. Cartoons from back in the day. Back in the 70s. Tom and, and Jerry. Come on, you could do better than that. Tom <laughs> I didn't and Jerry. Watch them, no, didn't really watch you did. Them. What were you so doing right in here. the? You were doing something else. I'm worried uh, about you. No, I was just out all the time. I was out. How could you be out when be you were seven and eight? Because we used to. Did you have a TV? Yes, I had what? a TV. But like weekends and at night, we'd be out all day, and then we'd come back later at night time. And probably by the time we used to get home at night time, it was pretty much home tea and sort of getting ready for bed. I mean, it was. Sometimes. You worry me. You worry me. You you uh, you now are beginning to worry me. I tell you what else I used to like, right? And I I was a right little sod at school. That's right. That's your side of the road, mate. Um, so <laughs> you were a TV addict, though. I not. was an absolute TV addict. I absolutely loved it. We're going to Dunkin' for a donut, right? I'm going to treat you to a donut. Um, Back in the day, it was way, way better. You're gonna have to wait there a minute while I go and get a donut, but then, then we'll, we'll f don't go anywhere. Just stay there, stay there, because I'm gonna go and get a donut and a coffee, and then we'll continue this on. But she, you need help, you do. I don't. It's you, just that I, I'm like it now. I don't watch loads of TV. Yeah, but back in the day when the t TVs were yeah. better back then, I had a black and white TV, and this is how. It used to add to it, you'd have a TV with a circular round metal aerial and you'd end up twisting it like that, right? Thinking it's not getting... And then you'd have click, 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 click and then you'd tune it in like that and you'd be moving this aerial around and, and it'd be broke like off. Where, where, My what aerial you... was plugged into the back of the TV. From the roof. I had a well, yeah, we had we that never, as well. I didn't have, ever have a one that you had with to a, move around. A round circular yeah. aerial with black and white, and, and I, you didn't have a very good night seventies and eighties. You did. I did, but I didn't watch lots of TV. We was out and about a lot. Well, did you eat chocolate bars? Yeah. Back then. Yeah, clearly where it is. Buttons. Buttons. Do you remember finger Buttons. bobs? Not really. No. Flumps. I love flumps. You've done flumps. No, no, flumps is the sweets. Oh, the, the yeah, Marsh the marshmallowy things. things. Jelly yeah. tots, tutti frutis. They brought tutti frutis back out, but they don't even taste like the old tutti frutis. What about spangles? Now, that was my nickname as a kid. Why? Because we used to have spangles on a Saturday. Oh, that, so was, some... that was your treat? You had some spangles? No, I was only allowed sweets once a week. You weren't allowed, you didn't watch TV, <laughs> you weren't allowed to have any sweets. Yeah, I was allowed to have sweets, but we only had sweets on a Saturday. But my mum used to bake, so I mean, I had plenty of things. That's probably where the puddings things come from. What about the biscuits, the malt biscuits, sports oh, biscuits? they were. And they'd have the little characters, the sports and, and the... And the... I still like those, now malted milk, you have to get one every now and again. But occasionally, if I have a coffee, which is about once or twice a week, I have to dunk one of them coffee oh hey and what about wagon wheels oh wagon we used to have a bus come a, a, a van come up my road um burton's and we used to buy a wagon wheel off them for like eight pence eight, eight pence, pence for a wagon, a wagon wheel, wheel they, were like that. they were like that and then also you used to have if you like a lot of chocolate on your biscuit join a club join our club yeah, clubs. Right? but now Hot if you go can you remember the pop van that used to come round? Oh yeah, we remember pop. the pop van. But the clubs now, if you like a lot of chocolate on your biscuit, you used to be able to buy at the end of the club you off. Did. And there was like a thick block of chocolate it's on the end. It's not that now, is it? Now you buy at the end, it's like, oh, it's the biscuit, <laughs> what's going on there? It's, it's all changed. It's r rubbish. You know, if, if anybody who, out there who is working for Cadbury's or Roundtree or, or whatever, why have, why have you made everything so bloody small? And you've made it crap, you've ruined they've it. They've made it smaller, like I said today about those chips. They've like made the portions smaller so they don't put prices up. 
<laughs> yeah, but they, yeah. Use, they, they use an excuse. Oh, it's for health reasons because we don't need Rubbish. to be eating as much. What a load of cobblers. You've done it to save yourself money, make yourself bigger yeah. profits. And uh, yeah, that's why. Back in the day, it was way better. Chocolate bars were just way better. Yeah. Heroes were thicker back then, and then whispers came out. I even remember when prawn cocktail crisps came out, and I was, I was like, oh, the first day they came out, I was <laughs> at school, cocktail. I got off some prawn cocktail crisps, prawn prawn scampi cocktail. fries as well. Oh, they was nice, wasn't it? And the fish and chips that you used to get in the packet in the like the newspaper, I like. Yes, those. they were nice, weren't yeah. they? And then back in the day as well, you'd have, uh, you'd have the fake cigarettes and you'd think you were grown up you know the <laughs> candy cigarettes and now the candy sticks now yeah. politically correct uh, again i guess that's probably right um but it was just way back paces as well do you remember paces no no you don't remember paces i'll tell you an advert that used to come on as well because i'm not getting as a donut this is it but this is where i mean back in the day tv commercials were better i remember you sunk my battleship <laughs> Say, my battleship. A game you can play anywhere. Battleship from Milton Bradley. Remember that one? Yeah. Yeah. And then you'd have another one where it was like Tin Can Alley and it was some guy and he's like... Ch -ch -ch. Hello, I'm Chuck Connors and this is Tin Can Alley. And it would like be a beam of light. Tin Can Alley. It was better. Action man with gripping hands <laughs> and eagle eyes. You'd, you'd, it'd, move, it'd, it'd move, you know. Yeah, I did, didn't I? It was, oh, was it Hornby train sets back then as yeah, well. They were. Yeah, they Horn... Scale electric. Scale electric, Hornby train sets. I that... had an Orville. You had an puppet. Orville? The green puppet that was in. What did you have an Orville puppet Cause for? Because I, I like, that was a TV programme with Orville on it. The thing. It, it was, yeah. And I had one as a puppet. Orville. Do you remember, oh, there's somebody at the door. There's somebody at the door. Oh, there's somebody at the door. Oh, there's somebody at the door. <laughs> There's somebody at the door. It was grot bags. It was yes. rather than an emu. Ah, grot bags here. Well, go on, do your job. Oh, Broadcast to the nation. Tell them what's on. Yeah, grot bags. Grot bags came round here, and I remember meeting her once as well. So I, I was in awe. Oh, it's grot bags. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's. Don't go anywhere. Stay there. <laughs> Look what's just happened, guys. I said. When you get in the car, put the lid on your coffee. I know. And you didn't. It's all over me car. <laughs> it's all over me But the way he gave me so I don't get it on his seatbelt. Well, don't get but on my seatbelt. Right, <laughs> I burnt myself. You burnt burnt me tummy. You've got coffee all inside me car now. <laughs> Good grief. It'll wash. Right, it will wash. You know what I say? Put the lid on it. I know. Right, I've got a couple more for you before we finish this off, but help me out here and pop it in the comments section down below because I loved the 70s and 80s and you're the wrong person to talk 70s and 80s with. I just can't remember things. Yeah, you would. I want to know what you were doing. Right, I, I right. had a really busy childhood. My parents, we was always doing something out exploring, my, say like say my dad had a boat and things like that. So. I was, we was out doing stuff. Right, anyway, are we taking you back home now? Yeah, I need to go home, because now I'm just right. covered in coffee. Hello, hello. <laughs> hello, hello, what about that one? Hello, yes, hello. I remember that. Oh, where oh, are you going? Where are you going? Um, so you've got hello, hello, and then another one, remember, um, when they met, it was murder. Because when they met, it was murder. <laughs> what was that? Can't remember. What, where were you in the yeah. 70s and 80s? Not watching TV all the time, obviously. Heart to heart. When they met, oh. it was Maida. No, you don't remember that one? Yeah, which was the one, was the one with the, was that heart to heart with the little... Freeway the dog. Freeway, no, gosh, bro. Was it a little um, clay man cord? What was that? That was Morph. That was it. That was Morph, take heart. But yes, I remember wow. that. Wow, you remember that yeah. one? Right, okay, we're getting somewhere. Who remembers Camp Coffee? Yes. You remember Do you know Camp what? Coffee? I used to like that and I bought some a few years ago. Oh gosh. And it ended up down your front. Yeah. <laughs> right, going into drinking coffee that I hardly ever drink it and most of it's down me anyway. So. Yeah, my valentine's going to have a job on now getting coffee out the side of my car. Oh, let's, let's get over that. So, come on, a few more things. Right, bicycles back then was better. Rally chopper. Oh, I had it. Rally chopper, yes. 
rally grifter didn't have a grifter but i had a um a rally chopper a, down, even eh? though i was the, a girl the, i had the one and i came off on my road and i ripped all the skin off my arm do you remember Oh, I need to show some sympathy there. Did you? Oh no! Wow. Do you remember? The, <laughs> do you remember um, Budgie? There was like a little version of the chopper. It was called the Budgie, I yes. think, the Rally Budgie. Uh, I think it was called. It, it, things were just so much simpler, so much better back in the day. It, join in with us. Pop it in the comment section. It's, I know it wasn't a food video, this, but it was just something totally different to take us out of this stupid times that we're in at the moment <laughs> I mean honestly it was, it's ridiculous isn't it you go back and there was there was they actually filmed a program here as well called Connie probably won't remember that it was Stephanie no. Beecham but it was filmed in Mansfield there you go a little bit of a little bit of trip question for you also what about um, the young ones I please tell me you that. watched the young ones you've got Rick Mayall yes you've got uh, Aid Edmondson Aid Edmondson God, that's bright Aid Ed Adrian Edmondson uh, you'd got um, there was Mike the cool person and still to this day right Sarah won't know I won't have a clue what I'm talking about <laughs> Uh, he, had, he did a line in it and he says uh, three minutes in the bathroom and Mike the cool person looks great as usual. Every time I come out of the bathroom I go three minutes in the bathroom and Lee looks great as usual and I always say that and it's from the young ones. Wow. There we go, the young ones, BBC Two, BBC Two, nine o'clock on a Tuesday I think it was. This feels maybe horrible, not, maybe it's all 10. wet and soggy. Anyway. Uh, <laughs> Easy, it's a family channel. Um, anyway, am I taking you back now? Though? Yes, you need to drop me off. All right, well, don't ask me in for a coffee. No, cause it's wait. Because it's all, it's all down your front. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, that was just, it's just a quick one today, really. It was just about nostalgia, is it this one? Uh, no. Uh, anyway, it was all about nostalgia. So if you can remember any TV programs, any chocolate bars, TV commercials, let's have a little comments in the section down below and let's have a little bit of fun and just take our mind off this <laughs> madness that is. Anyway, that's all from me today. Please do hit that subscribe button, click that little bell for notifications of when I upload new videos and we'll see you guys in the next one. Say bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> I'm going to go and get my car valeted now. Bye-bye. <laughs>